Hey guys, I'm Tesla and welcome back to another Unreal Engine 4 tutorial. In this one, we're going to be taking a look at physical materials. So I'm talking about taking this floor right here and making it really slippy like ice. Or maybe we're going to take it and make it really bouncy like jelly. So to do that, we need to create a physical material. So let's click materials. We'll drop down new. Come down to physics. We have physical material. Now I'm going to name this slippy floor. So now we can open this up and you can see we have friction, restitution and density. So this is slippiness basically, bounciness and how heavy objects will be on this surface. So I'm going to I'm going to make this really slippy. I'm going to put minus 1000, make it really ridiculous. So now let's close this. And we need to apply it to a, a surface a uh, material, sorry, so I'm going to choose this tech panel right here we can drop down, you see we have physical material, we can drop this down and we can now select our physical material so we have our slippy floor right here now I'm going to click apply and we can close this I'm going to drag this on to our floor and now let's jump in So everything's quite really kind of like slippy like ice now. So that's cool. Now let's make it really bouncy. So to do this we can easily create another physical material. Let's call this bouncy floor. I'm gonna open this up. I'm gonna put restitution all the way up to about I'm going to keep it about 15, let's see what that's like. Let's come to our tech panel. Drop down physical material and let's choose bouncy floor now. Let's click apply. Actually, yeah, it's already, it's already there, we can click play. Whoa, so it's, that's really bouncy. Okay guys, so that's a really quick look at physical materials and how we can apply them to our surfaces. Now there's one last thing I quickly want to show you, which I may do a future tutorial for. If we open up our phys physical material again, you can see we have physical properties and a surface type. And it's, set, and it's only default here, but we can define new surface types by coming to Edit, Project Settings, Physics, and we have surface types here and we can name these like glass, wood or metal and in blueprints we can define certain sounds or uh, particle effects to these so maybe we want it to sound really clangy when we're on the, when we're on the metal floor or we want if we, if we shoot the floor we have loads of wood splattering everywhere now um, I'm not going to cover that right now maybe in a future tutorial but thanks for checking this one out and make sure you stay subscribed for any future tutorials. Cheers guys.